Hey there, friends. How's it going? My name is Kevin. Oh, wait. Hold on. Yeah, sorry. I'm not used to being over here. And I'm not sure I like it. <laughs> this feels weird. But today, I needed to make some adjustments because we're doing something a little bit different. Oh, I can get very casual here now. Oh, it's like we're having a nice fireside chat. Except we're out the fire. Or anyone to talk to. I'm just talking to a camera. But today we're going to be playing some Kinect games and I'm really excited for this. I've had this Kinect for quite some time and I've had these games for quite some time but I've always been putting it off because it's a lot of setup to actually record it. It's a big change for my office. But the other day I was watching a video by uh, Eddie Burback who kind of summarized the, the launch of the Kinect and how Microsoft kind of oversold what it was capable of. It's a good video. I'd recommend it. But uh, it kind of got me hyped to actually set this up and actually go play them because I kind of forgot how bad they were but uh, um, even thinking about my own videos that I've done about it in the past brings back good memories. All right, troll, take a load of the Lord of the Dance. You don't have a chance, buddy. <laughs> So I'm excited to give it another go. I'm sure it'll be brilliant. So this is what we're going to be playing. Con Connectimals, I think it's called. This is one of those games that... Uh, I ran a game store, if you didn't know already. This is one of those games that was 50 cent, but no one ever bought anyway. <laughs> oh, look at him. <laughs> I made him sad. Hello. Oh, no. I don't like the narrator already. <laughs> I'm facing the camera. Identify me. What the hell noise was that? Hey, look at the state of his face. I'm not picking that one. I don't want him. <laughs> this is the longest intro known to man. I'm getting really bored. Oh my god, that long intro just to do a crab rave? Are you serious? Okay, that one has like some sort of vehicle. I'm picking that one. <laughs> oh, he does sick ramps and everything. Are you an adventurer? An explorer? A mountain climber, perhaps? Imagine how disappointing it would be after he listed all those things and I'm just like, no, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a YouTuber. <laughs> God, my eye has gone so bloodshot. I think my eye is rejecting the game. It doesn't want to play. What? Uh, go away, rejects. I don't want you. I want... No, I don't want the stone. I want Black Panther. He's the only one to star in a film. I want his wealth. Excellent choice. Wait, no, I'm not rubbing you. I'm scratching my face. Go away. <laughs> We're not at that stage yet. Then give it a good pet. Sure to <laughs> I think I'm just slapping it. <laughs> Oh, it likes it though. <laughs> There's no animal protective service on this island, is there? When does it end? When do I get attention, game? <laughs> You're just making me rub him over and over again. What do I do? He's a creepy little shit, isn't he? A friend for life. Oh no, trust me, this is just for one video. <laughs> He sneezed on me, the fecker! I don't want your disease, like I'm new to this island! <laughs> would you like to name him? Of course I would. I think it's time we gave your little one a name. Don't you? Say it out loud. Shitbag! Oh, I like that. Oh, good! <laughs> See if your cub likes it too. Shitbag! Oh, he loves it. That's so cute. My little shitbag. Get your diseases away from me, like he's gonna kill me! Would you like to scan a picture or something to identify this cub? Yeah, sure, why not? Just an awkward picture of me sitting there. <laughs> no, I think we'll have to find something for that. Okay, here you go. Here's your picture. It's bloody terrifying. I think we're happy with the results. What do you think? You look kind of terrifying though, but it's oddly fitting. It looks like a boomer Facebook picture, <laughs> just way too close to the feckin' camera. No that you have your, uh, pub companion? Just say it. Just say shitbag. That's his name. This is going to be great. I don't even know what's going on, to be honest. I think I'm just on a mad trip. And I don't mean trip as in, like, a vacation. I think I'm tripping balls, like, really, really hard. I've just arrived on this island for no apparent reason, and I'm just following this magical thing around. Place where you and your new friend oh, he's so stupid. I guess we're not so different after all. <laughs> Trick learns. Sit down. I've learned that too. Let's start easy. Jump in the air. Are you serious? I actually have to do this. I don't want to leave my seat. Is that enough? The whole ground shook. Can I just stand up? Yes. <laughs> when you do a trick. When I do a trick, <laughs> just standing up. Now spin in place. Oh, for feck's sake. I gotta take out my earphones and everything. All right. At least it's easy with the seeds. Don't fall over. Oh, this is terrifying. My legs are too long for this. Why is he not reacting? Do the trick. He's not spinning. All I'm doing is getting dizzy. Did he do it? Okay, I'm legit dizzy after that. <laughs> well, that's my exercise for the day done. <laughs> the play dead trick. All you have to do is lie flat on your back. Go ahead. Don't be shy. Play dead? Dude, I do that naturally all the time. <laughs> Maybe this wasn't a good game to record. <laughs> all right, if you need me, I'll be down here. 
out of frame. I don't think the camera can even see me. <laughs> But it worked, I guess. Oh my god. <laughs> this fucking game. I just want to sit there motionless, dying away slowly. I don't want to do any sort of movement or exercise. I'm sure the audio sounds great when I'm just spinning. Ever done a star jump before? How am I supposed to do a star jump in this tiny office? Do you know how big my wingspan is? I'm starting to understand why this game was 50 cent and no one wanted it. Hey! Your pals brought you a new ball to play with. Aren't I supposed to be the one getting a ball from my pet? I want off this damn island, I'm going mad! <laughs> that was zero effort, I just kinda threw it on the floor. The shallows! It's where the river winds itself through the woods. It's so nice and cool there. Would you like to see it? Uh, sure. I mean, I'm lying to you when I'm saying yes, but I mean, I don't think I have any other choice. <laughs> Be a contender. That's what I need. More participation trophies. What the hell is this? <laughs> Remember to throw under him. Oh, now you tell me. Fucking hell, this is embarrassing. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> okay, I did it with four seconds to spare. That deserves a participation trophy. Oh wait, there's a round two? <laughs> Throwing under him is the best way to aim accurately. I don't know, I think just spamming is actually better. <laughs> yeah, this is way better. <laughs> I'm just spamming. Try to throw Stop telling me these underhanded tactics. <laughs> Throwing underhand is the best way to improve your aim. Why does he keep telling me this when I'm hitting everything perfectly? <laughs> Step left and right to help line up your target. I'm already done and he's trying to help me. A new high score. Gold, I deserve it. <laughs> Get off of me, you've got diseases, shitbag. Will you look at that view? It is pretty nice. It almost substitutes going outside. It's good enough for me anyway, I'm not going out today. Anytime you want to play with one of your toys, open your toy box. All you have to do is hold your arm out to the bottom right. I'm trying, but it's... It's hard, apparently. Uh, I'm really trying. <laughs> it's not doing anything. <laughs> I'm so disappointed, it's not doing anything, come on! Okay, he just gave up on me, he left. He's getting right on my face. He's like, get your shit together, all right? Do you want to play? No. Choose whether or not to play with the item by holding your arm out to the right for yes or to the left for no. Jesus Christ, you are so feckin' needy. No, I don't want to teach you any tricks. I think I, I'm not really getting the point of this game. <laughs> I play a game that's solely about playing with an animal. I'm like, I don't want to. All right, fine. Do you want to give my animal a drink? Yeah, feed him some whiskey. Put him to sleep. At least then I'll get some feckin' peace. No, I don't want to play at all, okay? I'm pissed off with you. Oh my god, everything about this was annoying. <laughs> all right, yes, let's play. What? No, not this again! <laughs> sake, I'm not even throwing them. They're just kind of glitching all over the place. <laughs> trying to throw it at my feckin' bed. <laughs> Leave me alone, get out of here. I don't love you anymore. <laughs> When the bar fills up to the top. <laughs> I didn't even mean to throw that at you, sorry. I feel like I'm just directing traffic now all of a sudden. <laughs> it always comes down to this. <laughs> I missed a calling there, I'm really good at it. Or maybe like a conductor. <laughs> I can almost hear the music now. Have a look in your toy box. Hold your arm out to your bottom right. It doesn't do it. It doesn't, it doesn't do it. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna get right up in this thing's grill and sort it out. Right, go. Bottom right. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm sick of this game. I think I should say I'm sick of the Kinect. It just doesn't want to work sometimes. And it's got like the most ideal setup right now. It's got loads of space. It's got more lighting than any normal person would have. Feed the frogs. Jesus Christ, I don't want to feed them. They're demonic. Okay, I've changed my mind. I want to feed them. Will you please go into the mouth? Thank God. <laughs> this is taking me far too long. Oh my God, he's got his car back out. That's a hell of a whip. Yes, this is actually something I want to play with. To drive the car, imagine you have a steering wheel in front of you. Push both hands forward to drive. This is a hundred times less fun than I thought it would be. <laughs> I don't know why I thought this would be cool. At least I'm getting to run over my pet a bit. I don't see how this is fun for the pet. He's not even interacting. There you go. Fucking kill him. <laughs> Oh, that's a really cool trick, is it? I am uh, kind of impressed by how good it is at, like, judging whether I'm going forward or, or back. That is actually kind of impressive. This poor animal. <laughs> Get out of the way, you little shitbag! <laughs> I'm saying that affectionately, that's his name. Oh, fantastic, I've unlocked a new area. There'll be lots of exciting adventures, I assume. I think we've gotten past the tutorial part now. We've learned how to care for our pet, even though I've chosen not to. <laughs> but I think we're ready for some real challenges. Old Stone Circle. The first people built it, but no one knows why. 
could be an ancient calendar. Or maybe just a pile of big rocks. Drive the remote control car around the course as quickly as you can. Okay, I should be able to do this. This this is good, actually. The driving was my strong suit. I didn't expect this. I gotta be honest. I really didn't expect this. They were saying this is some ancient old stone circle, like Stonehenge or something. Isn't this a bit disrespectful to set up a racetrack around Stonehenge? They're trying to get me to jump to collect these things. I'm not jumping. I'm a responsible driver. A new high score. Yeah, I don't like to brag, but I'm probably the best person to ever play this game. I'm probably the only person to play this game that's actually old enough to drive, to be fair. <laughs> Looks like the Cub wants to go back to Woodland Glade. Like, I went through all that, like, all those games I was playing earlier with the ball and the race car was to unlock that area. We spend, like, 30 seconds there and then we're done. <laughs> What are you looking at me like that for? <laughs> They're like, well, that's about all the content we have. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm being attacked. Kill it. <laughs> Somebody shoot it. Just open your toy box. And I really wish I could open my toy box. I have no idea how to do that. I would like to look at the map. I would like to go see my house, but I can't. <laughs> open my toy box. Like it's detecting my, my arm is going out there. So why isn't it doing it? <laughs> I think it just thinks I'm like really oddly proportioned <laughs> because I'm sitting down. I don't think you're supposed to be sitting down when you do this. It's like I'm a 12 year old who has really long arms and can almost touch their feet without even bending over. <laughs> yes! I got into my toy box! Yes! I'm so happy! I stood up and it worked! It suddenly got threatened when it realized I wasn't a 12 year old with really long arms. That I was a fully grown adult playing this game. Or else it just felt bad for me. That's probably more likely. Hey! Feck off! I hate you! <laughs> He's really getting on my nerves. You're going to love what the lemurs have for sale. Wait, I'm not funding these lemurs. I don't want to give them money. I don't know what they're spending it on. It could be gang violence. You picked the wrong house, fool! No, no, don't buy it! The Kinect is just picking up on things I'm not doing. Yeah, it probably wasn't for you. Do I need to buy food? Do pets need to eat? Honestly, I think I might need some food. I've been stranded on this island and all I've done is played with this cat, which honestly I think is a mirage. I think I'm hallucinating. If you like, I'll show you how to decorate your home by selecting the decorate button. <sighs> you're mad with this bottom right thing, but you don't detect when I'm doing it. Come on, come on. I think your cub might like a new bed. This cub is getting better treatment than I am. I don't have a bed. <laughs> Interior designer. I just threw a sheet on the floor. I didn't even straighten it. I was just like, man. What the hell is Fur Town? I feel like this is a risky click. Oh my god, look at this little picture. That is so scary. Okay, so I guess this is just where you can swap between pets, but I don't even want one, not a mine two. You can exit any time by holding your arm out to the bottom right. Which means I'm not allowed to leave at all. <laughs> it's so difficult to hold your arm out to the bottom right in this game. Be sure to give them some food every now and then. Oh, feeding him? Yeah, sure. It's about time I feed him. I bought him a single carrot. <laughs> I'm gonna force him to be a vegetarian, even though he is obviously a carnivore. I, I keep feeding him. I'm overfeeding him now by accident. I'm trying to play tug of war with him. Here, take, take, take it. Take the food. Ta He's running away. <laughs> For heck's sake, this is so frustrating. <laughs> like, I gotta think that this must be, like, the perfect conditions for this game, and it's still not working. That's it. I'm going home. I'm abandoning my pet. I don't love him anymore, and I don't think I ever did when I think about it. Like, I'm convinced none of this exists, especially this fairy thing. Especially going off how bloodshot my eye looks. I think I'm just really high, honestly. <laughs> I think that's a good time to end it, though. Because if I don't, I feel like I'm I'm gonna wanna die. There's gotta be some good Kinect games out there, though. I'm convinced they must exist. I think this is something we should look into. I think we've tried two of them. The Harry Potter one was amazing <laughs> in a bad way. This is just bad. <laughs> I'm disappointed it exists. Even now, like, I am not moving and the hands are just freaking out. It doesn't know what's going on. I think it should have some kind of inbuilt thing that it's like, okay, this person is obviously having some sort of seizure and it should call the emergency hotline because my arms are freaking out. All right, I'm going to stop before these magical hands, like, delete my profile somehow. But I, I can't stop it, so I'm going to have to hurry and do an outro. Um, I hope you enjoyed. I know I did. I appreciate watching as always. If you want to see more Connect games, do let me know and also maybe suggest some because I'm not that familiar. I have loads of them now. I bought a lot of them, so I am ready to play them. I just have to pick out the good ones, I suppose. And this is kind of freaking me out because I don't know what it's going to click on next. Uh, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.